Let's say we want to reflect this triangle over this line, a line x equals negative 3, rather than the x-axis or the y-axis. So we have reflecting triangle ABC over the line x equals negative 3. Okay, and this here is the line x equals negative 3 because anywhere on this line x equals negative 3. It doesn't matter what the y value is. Uh, x is always negative 3 on this line. So graphically this is similar to uh, reflecting over the y-axis because we're just going to treat this kind of like we would if we were doing the y-axis just see how far away it is. So this point here is two units from the line x equals negative 3. So we're going to go two units to the right of it. So we end up right here. So we have 1, 2, 1, 2. I'm going to keep the same height. So this is B prime now. Same thing for points A and C. C is two units away, so we're just going to move two units horizontally. And we get C prime is right here. And now uh, point A, point A is one, two, three units from the line. So we have to go three units to the right of it. So one, two, three. And we would end up on the y axis. That's okay. A prime. So our reflection or our image of triangle ABC would look like this. So it's probably best to do this graphically and then we'll just get the coordinates from it or even if you just make a sketch. So we have A prime is now 0, 1. C prime is negative 1, 2. And B prime is negative 1, 5. Okay, so similarly, let's reflect this over a vertical line. We're going to reflect triangle ABC over the line Y equals negative 1. So here we have the line Y equals negative 1. Okay, and this line represents negative 1 because anywhere on the line, the Y value is negative 1. doesn't matter what the X value is it's negative 1 for the y value all along this line. So we'll just treat it like we've treated everything so far with reflection. Point A is one, two spots away from the y-axis, so we'll go two spots below it. And we end up with A prime right here. Okay, C prime is at 5, 2, so we have to go 1, two, three spots. So I have to go three spots below it. One, two, three. Then we end up with C prime being right here. And B prime is at negative five, five. So this is six spots away. So we have to go six spots uh, below this, below this, uh, line y equals negative 1. We're actually going to go a little off the chart. We'll just add a line here. Call this negative 7. And this is b prime. Let's clean this up a little bit. And now we can draw a triangle. So we're able to get our new coordinates graphically and uh, actually graph it. And from looking at this, we can now figure out the coordinates. If we look at the graph, we see that A prime is at negative 6 negative 2. C prime is at 
negative 5, negative 3, and b prime is at negative 5, negative 7. So a quick sketch uh, easily helps us figure out the coordinates for the image if we reflect triangle ABC over the line Y equals negative 1.